So that's my little thing, bang, bang. But how I do that? Not peace out. Until next time, I just hit myself in the face. Now he hit himself <laughs> in the face. Until next time. Bang, bang. What's wrong with you? Hello guys, welcome back to Seven Kids and Husband. Hello. My name is... My name is Hello. Lou. My name Hello. is Louis. Yes. My name is Louis, and this is my beautiful, annoying wife, Andrea. And today we are doing another reaction video because we know how much you guys enjoy these reactions. Mm -hmm. React to. We are re reacting to if be, people be, 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 be. if people were honest with their parents. I have not seen this video, but I'm oh. guessing if children were honest with their parents, what would they really say? They so, would die. <laughs> I will link the video down below if you want to see the original mm -hmm. and watch and not watch our awesome, awesome reaction video. But before you go to that video, leave a like and subscribe and watch this video anyway. So, yes. without further ado, dun, 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 dun. let's get some kids well, killed. Let's, let's hear what they're talking about. I'm tired. I'm tired. Why don't you put that phone up and talk to me real quick? My bad. How's school going? How's, how's your grades look? It's, it's going really good. Uh, some of the classes were a little bit tough at first, but I got some tutoring. But the grades come out Monday, and I think everything's going to look really good. I want you to know that I'm proud of you. You know, I wasn't that bright. I wasn't the smartest cookie in the jar. You know, I could barely could read, but hey, I'm living through you. Keep that thing 100, cuz. Hey, uh. Why don't you put that phone up and talk to me real quick? My bad. How's school going? How your grades look? Um, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much uh, flunking out of school. Last semester was, was tough, and then uh, I fell below a 2.0, so they put me on academic probation. So if you do that back to back, they suspend you for an entire year. So I'm pretty much sure. I'm, I'm, it's guaranteed that I'm running up on that year suspension. Uh, they're not going to let me stay on campus. I'm not going to be able to keep my job on campus because I'm not going to be a full-time student. So I'll probably end up coming back here and eating y'all out of house and home. Come I was again. a little upset about it at first, but then I thought about it like, yo, everybody deals with trials and tribulations, and this is just a test from God. And I know y'all got my back and gonna continue to pay my bills even though I'm home, so I'm not really worried about it. School ain't for everybody. Uh, come sit next to me. Uh, grab me a knife real quick, though. Hey, Pops, how's it going? Um, you think I could go out with some of my friends tonight? We just gonna catch a movie. Did, did you clean your room up? No, no, I, I, didn't, I didn't clean up anything. Well, then your ass ain't going nowhere. Go, go clean the room up. If I do that right now, it's, it's gonna be damn near past my curfew when I, when I finish. Like, can, can it wait till later? Bye. Get out my face. That's me. Tell the truth. Yeah. Tell That's us how me. you really feel. What's really on your chest instead of hair. Hey, Pops, what's, what's going up, on? Son? I was wondering if I go out with some of my friends tonight. It's going to be a crazy yeah. party. They're going to be drinking. They're going to be smoking. I'm not really messing with none of that, but it's still cool to be around them when they're doing all that stuff. And the girls get hella loose when they're intoxicated. Did you clean your room up? No, 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 no. What I did in the room is I straightened up a little bit. So if you looked in there and took a quick glance, it might look like I cleaned up. But I really took the bulk of all the junk that I needed to clean up and threw it up under the bed. You oh, no, me? that's <laughs> Sammy. Right? That's Sammy. No, see, I'm not doing that. You tripping, see? Um, you're sitting down, I'm standing up, and I know I'm faster than you. I'm grown. You, you, you gotta come home. Good evening, come on in, take a seat. Oh, sorry about the robe. I don't really substitute uh -huh. my comfortability for anybody. What brings us to this uh, parent, teacher, student, slash my son meeting? Oh, well, um, I'll let him tell you about his behavior. Mm. Go ahead. Well, I just first want to start off saying this is so unlike me to have behavior problems like this, but I've just been going through a lot. I've been getting bullied in the classroom. Um, I feel like my teachers, they don't like me. I feel like everyone's against me. And um, dad, you work so much, I just feel like I, I wish I could get more attention at home. Also, so That's why the kids play you. She fall down. for that shit all the time. She fall for that shit. So kids will say anything to take it out of trouble. Know. You fall for that shit, bro. Well, I know there's probably some other things going on, but I think the first thing we need to do is get him some help. Yeah, yeah, I guess uh, we'll, we'll, we'll work to get him um, some help. Keep it 100 for the one time, for the one time. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Good evening. Come on in. Take a seat. Oh, sorry about the robe. I don't really substitute my comfortability for anybody. What brings us to this uh, parent, teacher, student, slash my son meeting? Well, before we get started, I, I just want to thank you both for coming in. I know it's after hours, and um, 
I'll let him get kind of started on what's been going on and tell his side of the story first. Go ahead. I'm going to be honest. Like, the, the school is trash. Like, the school is trash overall. It, it's just a trash school. Absolutely, you're right. We, we're the worst ranked in the entire county, and the teachers don't care. They're beating the students to the parking lot. When the bell rings, they're not making sure we get on our buses or we get home safe or we're staying at the school to see if anyone needs tutoring or any of that. They getting straight in their car and beating the school buses out of the parking lot. And to be honest, the teachers are on their phones the entire time. I understand like if it's free time or we just chilling the last two, three minutes of class, but the teachers are literally on our phone. And Ms. Jenkins, no we, we, we found out Ms. Jenkins was on Tinder, busting it wide open. Like oh, what this kind of example is she leave? I don't care about this Stop school. Y'all not even teaching us the right stuff. Teach us how to file our taxes or, or how to bust. Y'all teaching us dumb stuff that I'm never gonna use that's in my true. life. That's, that's why I don't that's care. True. I don't care if I get in trouble, I don't care if I'm talking to a class. All of this stuff is pointless information that I'm never gonna use in my life. <laughs> uh, uh, look, uh, your mother wanted me to talk to you. I know we never had this talk before about the birds and the bees, but uh, are you sexually act? I, I, I haven't done anything like that before, <laughs> Pops. Um, I, I'm, I'm in the V Club still. The V Club. Why you, why you say that? But, uh, he probably I'm already a triple friend, ba- baby daddy or something. Talk about it like here and there, but not too much. Sitting there it's saying no. Um, but we, we all think we're just going to wait till we get married and, and just find someone and live happily ever after sure. and fall in love and have a, a white picket fence. Like my focus right now is just on school and uh, being a better person. Oh, that's it. Hey, hey, and that's awesome. You're making the right decision and, and that's how you're supposed to live. Thanks. Love you. Hey, you already know what's about to happen, but on the radio, how you doing today? Yeah, you, you, you ain't gonna say, how you doing today? Don't, don't look around the room, look at your phone, look at your computer. I'm talking to you, how you doing today? Well, fine, don't, don't, don't say nothing. Uh, okay, uh, no, no other way to put it, but your mom want me to have this conversation with you. Are you having sexual intercourse? Are you putting your knife in somebody's peanut butter? Are you going down below the waist and trying to get a taste? Are you taking your baseball bat and trying to see where it's at. Are you trying to find a bun <laughs> for your hot dog? Oh, 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 most definitely. Hey, I mean, <laughs> and the crazy part about it, like, the first time I knocked ankles loose, like, the, the, the young lady was way more experienced than me, and, and I really wasn't ready. She damn near took something, like, it, it was borderline rape, and that shit ain't funny. She damn near took something, and I wasn't ready for it. She had bodies. She had bodies. I think she was in the double digits. Oh, yeah. But the second She's time tired. around, it was crazy. I was like on an equal playing field with the young lady. I oh, thought so you really had But then I found out she hooked up with my homeboy. So I was like, damn, I can't even walk around in public with her because she low key smashed the home. You know what I'm saying? And, and the third chick, the, the other joint I'm messing with right now, like I'm still trying to fill it. You should out. You know, shut I don't up. Really know the background, background. People be lying on the first couple days, but, but, but I knocked them angles loose on that second date. Oh, nah. Okay, um, you, 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 you <laughs> got a lot going on. Is, is there anything else you want to tell me? You can be honest. I'm not going to get mad. Uh, I, um, I, 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 I use protection at least half of the time. You out here raw, dummy? Bring your All right, guys. That was if people were honest with their parents. And keep lying to your parents. Don't. Keep lying to us, kids. People. Keep lying. People have been lying to their parents for generations and gener- and, gener- and generations. And it saves lives. We lying say we want to know the truth. We don't. Lying saves lives. So, hope you guys enjoyed that video. Leave a comment down below. Like, subscribe, and until next video, peace out. Peace out. That's my little thing. Bang, bang. But how I do that? Not peace out. Until next time, I just hit myself in the face. No, you hit yourself in the face. <laughs> until next time. Bang, bang. What's wrong with you? Mia's crying. We gotta go. Deuces. Yeah.